I love being able to add that many toppings and just pile it as high as you want. Like I have. Hey, yours is ridiculous. Look. Hello and welcome to a very special episode of the vlog because we still have Jason here in Canada with me, my American friend, the first time back in a long time, and I'm taking him to none other than, oh, uh, hello. Hello again. It's so good to see it you It is again. good to see you. So I'm taking him to a very Canadian place, Harvey's. What do you know about Harvey's? Is he your buddy? <laughs> He's not my buddy. I don't know much uh, other than you ate poutine here once. That's right. In a that's, video. That's right. One of our videos, I came here and got poutine. But this is a... I don't a, know what you're supposed to get here. I don't know what the thing is. Is it like burgers? It's a burger place, okay. yeah. But so it's like a McDonald's-ish no, type deal? No. no. It's, you get to go in there and basically top your own burger while they do it in front of you. Oh. Yeah. It's very exciting. So it's like a Subway. Yeah. But with burgers. Yeah. I guess that's, yeah, okay. Okay. I'll give, I'll give you that. They did some really cool marketing thing where they call it Harvey's with an E-H, apostrophe S, instead of Harvey's. Right. I like that. I love it, Harvey's. Truly Canadian. Yeah. They Canadian. should have made that original that way in the first place. They should have, that would have been smart. All right, so we'll go in, we'll get a burger combo, yeah. and uh, we'll, you'll try your first Harvey's burger. Okay. And maybe uh, a poutine or something else that they might have that, we'll find something else interesting on the menu. Yeah, we'll see what we can get. I'm excited, let's go. They got the big harv. I gotta try that. You gotta get the original, just the either the double. Yeah, or... you gotta do the number one, right? Yeah, you gotta the do the quarter number pounder one. combo. Yeah. The fries and a mug root beer. An iced tea. Iced tea. The Nesty's iced tea. Well, it's, it's, this it's... is brisk. All right. It's Pepsi products. Do they have brisk there in the states. Oh yeah. Like sweet. Yes. Okay. I know they got the like they got the crazy poutine. Oh, they got a buffalo chicken poutine. But we should get it. Okay. Which one do you want? The buffalo chicken, just because you're from Buffalo, see how it holds up? I don't know. So you gotta do the classic. Yeah. All right, let's do the classic. Yeah. That's like your baseline for everything. You gotta true. do the classic and then you'll know like how it compares to the other yeah. stuff. Yeah. Fries at Harvey's have always been really, really good. Yeah. Hi there. How's it going? I'll just do the number one combo. What would like on it? Uh, lettuce, tomato, pickle, onion. That's it. What would like on the side? The frings. frings. Yeah. Oh, I'm gonna get the big Harv. Combo comes as its own flavored thing. I don't know, I usually get everything. You usually put everything on my burger. It says you gotta try it with the signature sauce. See, I gotta try it with the uh, the Harb sauce. And then everything, just throw it all, everything else on there. Yeah, I'm not picky. Any hot peppers? Yep. yep. We're also gonna get a, a regular classic poutine. Salt. That's it. Okay. That's the way to go. You don't get ice? What are you, nuts? Ice just makes it uh, watered down. Keeps it cold though in the hot sun where we're going to. <laughs> Got it? Thank, thank you right. very much. Thank you. All right, let's go outside. Eating together in real life. Springs. I don't know if that's yours. Oh, this is yours. Yeah, the big. It's like 20 times heavier. Look what it says on there too. Grilling with flame since 1959. I don't know. I guess it started. Somebody tell us where this place started and why it's so Canadianized. Look at this. Oh my God. Look at this monstrosity. Look. How is it? It's pretty big. It's not like your uh, standard fast food here. One fork, thanks. Oh my goodness. Well, what do you think? It's good. Mm. Mm. It's like a, it's different than fast food. It's like a combo between fast food and cooking at home. Yeah. <laughs> You're right. Mm. Oh my God, the big heart. I really like being able to add that many toppings and just pile it as high as you want. Like I have. Yeah, yours is ridiculous. Mine's crazy. Mine was already big to start with because it's called the Big Harv. Then I made it bigger. How's your uh, sweet tea? Or your iced tea as we call it here. Sweet and delicious. These onion rings are really good. Harvey's always been good with the fried stuff. <laughs> and then they had a poutine to their menu. Brilliant. Well, you can't be proudly Canadian and not serve poutine. Fries are good. 
Yeah, you like them? Mm -hmm. So I imagine the poutine would be pretty good too. Uh, oh my God. It's that real cheese, not just uh, sprinkled cheese. It's got the curds in there, They're legit. I need a second fork. Don't eat my stuff. I can't promise anything. <laughs> so while I have you here to myself, getting pretty full. Also, never mind, here he comes. What are you saying? I can't leave you two alone for a minute? No, just scoop it out. Oh my God. I mean, it's hard to screw this up. Mm -hmm. But you got a good base of the fries that I know they're good. And they throw the cheese in the gravy. I almost like the other poutine better from the Halifax Donair. Halifax Donair. I would hope so because there's a little more love and care. I would definitely hope you would. Yeah. But it's good. It's not bad. Yeah. You just want fast food poutine. Fast food poutine. It's an amazing accomplishment because you can't you can't get that over there. Although I want to say McDonald's tasted better. I did this last time. You I did. said Harvey's tasted better. Mm -hmm. For another day. Another day, my friend. Maybe another week. So what do you think? The meat? How do you feel about the meat? Kind of lacking in flavor. Mm. Feels more like filler than it does a flavorful burger. Mm -hmm. I don't disagree. I think the thing that saves it is all the toppings that you put on. Oh yeah. If it was just the burger and some ketchup. You wouldn't be as happy. I don't think so. I also don't think it compares to a McDonald's burger. But the, the meat? No. The meat itself we're talking? The meat of a McDonald's burger is better than this? No, 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 no. Yep. How? The American Big Macs. More flavorful. Yeah, okay. With the sauce and the meat. Just because it's thick doesn't mean it tastes good. All right. I, I, I'm probably, you, you might be uh, maybe right. not in the same boat as most people. Mm hmm. But I'm not getting it. Strong words. Well, oh yeah, give me a burger out of five maple leaves. Without the toppings, low twos. Wow. Mm -hmm. With the toppings, I'll give it a three. Okay. All right. Wow. Yeah. That's low. How about the rings? Rings are good. Can't screw up rings. No. Just deep fry them. Mm -hmm. But I've had better rings, okay. so I can't give it a five. No. Three and a half. And the fries? Fries are good. Three and a half to four. Poutine? Two and a half. Oh, wow. There you go. Canada. Sorry, wow. Sorry Canada. Kind of hit, hating on Harvey's right now. Mighty big words. Low praise. <laughs> Low praise indeed. What do you think? Do you like it? I like Harvey's a lot. But I do see your point about the, the meat being just kind of bland. It must be the novelty of doing the stuff that like adds the flavor in my mind. <laughs> yeah, Maybe. I mean you added a ton of stuff. I, also, I do. I do love everything. The more you add, the less you taste the burger. Too. Yeah, I'm impressed. I bet with you the... you could do all of that without a burger. It'd still be good. It'd still be good. <laughs> That's true. I would say that you're right. Like the 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 meat is like the thickness of the burger is impressive for a fast food type place. Um, yeah, I think that's probably what they're trying to hang their head on. Yeah, and they are. And, and they, separate themselves. I have to compare not. it to my experience. Mm -hmm. Hey, that's what you that's what you know. That's what you that's what you've tasted. That's what you think. An American speaks. Well, thank you, Jay, for for coming and enjoying this day with me and coming to Harvey's. What a crazy day. It's been good. We've done literally three episodes in this, in this one day together because you've got to go back now to the States. i got to head back. I'm sad about that. I know. What I feel we... like I was here for five minutes. You were? But yes. at the same time, I feel like I've eaten for five days. <laughs> yes, that's just true. It's hot. We're full, but I'm happy. Uh, uh, <laughs> <laughs> I think I'm gone blind. <laughs> oh, God. Can't even sit up, up anymore. Thanks for watching. If you liked the video, please hit like down below. I'm gonna strength back. There you and go. And subscribe if you really liked it. Hit the, the subscribe button down below and the bell beside there so you know when we put out another video. And if you want to watch some more of us, there's some more right here that you can you can look at it. We we've done some crazy things, American versus Canadian, and uh, hopefully there'll be more in person in the future. It better as be. the border restrictions ease and it's not as hard to get in as it was today for you. The red and white tape to get into Canada. This has been special. Now what? Now. There's some butter tarts in the, still in the car if you'd like. We better eat them quick before they go bad. <laughs>